So in this video, I'm going to go over exactly how I get my clients Google star reviews on their Google shopping listings. Now it's a very, very simple process. There's multiple ways to do it, but the way I'm going to show you is how to do it with the app called judge.me. So I like to use judge.me for my clients, but there's multiple other ones you can use. Uh, they all work very, very similar, but this is specifically how you do it with judge.me. So let's go through the process. First of all, you need to be on the paid plan. You can't be on the free plan because it doesn't have the integration to create the feed and connect to Google Merchant Center. That's number one. Number two is you need to add the product reviews to your sites and you need to have at least 50 verified reviews on your sites before you can actually qualify. Following that, you're going to actually fill in the Google Merchant Center application, which will be linked in the bottom of the description. And I'm going to go through this. Then you need to wait for an approval, which is often instant. So hopefully it is in the case in this tutorial today. And then you need to connect it to your Google Merchant Center, create the review feed in the Merchant Center, and then you just wait for an approval. And that takes a little while. It's about four weeks. And it's actually very, very simple, the whole process. But I'm going to go through it step by step while I set it up for this exact client. So first of all, what we're going to do, we've subscribed to the paid plan. We also have product reviews on our sites. We have 50 plus, so we're going to qualify. Next thing we're going to do is fill in this product rating interest form. Now, the way you want to do it, do you work with an approved third party of reviews aggregator? So what we're going to select is yes, but I would like to submit the feed from a supported partner directly in the Merchant Center myself. OK, and then we're just going to fill this in. So what we are uh, advertising is physical and digital products. And do we have more than 50 reviews? Yes. Okay. Then what we want to go through is just fill this in. And then we simply select submit. Most of the time it happens very instantly. So I'm hopefully going to wait for an email now so we can be approved and continue with this process. But what you're going to see here is under marketing, we only have promotions and ad campaigns now. However, when we qualify for this, we will also see reviews here. And just like that, we have received the confirmation email within five minutes. And now if I go to Google Merchant Center, we can see reviews in the marketing section here, which is great. Now we can carry on with the setup. So next on the list, we have filled in the Google Merchant Center application form. We've waited for approval, which happened in under five minutes. Now we need to start the connection to the Google Merchant Center so we can create the review feed. So let's do that now. So what you want to do is log on to your Shopify and within the app section, the only app I have access to is reviews. We want to go to the main section here and then go to marketing and social. And when we're in here, we want to go to Google and SEO. And from this, we have the section here for Google Shopping. So now we're in this section. What we want to select is generate the new review feed here. And when you're on judge.me, it's really, really easy to follow the instructions because they give it to you. So what I recommend is have this side by side with what you're doing. But first of all, what we've done, we've already done these steps here in terms of creating the form, getting it approved on the Merchant Center. And now what we want to do is actually generate and upload the product review feed. So we've gone to the settings and we've gone to generate the product review feed. We've done that. So the next steps are we need to go to the merchant center and actually create the feed and schedule a fetch for it. So let's do that now. So I'm just going to quickly get our names. So now we're in this section, I'm going to click on plus here and I'm just going to call this. I always do asterisks for growth judge.me. And we want to make sure we have schedule fetch selected. We want to click continue and we want to go to the file name and what we had here and we're going to have it matching this. So we have that there daily fetch. I typically like to do it before we start work in the morning. So five o'clock is fine. And this is the important bit. We need to do the file file URL, which is here. So the XLM URL, this is how it connects. There we go. And next thing we're going to do is just create feed. And there we have it there. We've now connected our judge.me review feed to our Google Merchant Center. Now, if you're not seeing this straight away, what I recommend you to do is make sure to click on fetch now a few times because it can be a little bit laggy. 
but if you keep on top of that that should be absolutely fine now we have everything set up unfortunately it isn't quite instant as you want it to be what we're going to have here is a status that says inactive here that your account isn't currently eligible for product ratings and this is because google has to go for a manual review of this so someone has to check everything aligned and works well and this can often take four to six weeks so that's why i always recommend and every time you have a client onboarded we do this pretty much immediately um, because it's very beneficial and it's also quite a long process of just waiting around. I'm going to put the link to the products rating interest form in the description along with the instructions on how to connect up with judge.me. But I hope, you, I hope that helped you out guys and like I say I run a marketing agency we specialize in Google ads for e-commerce brands. If you'd like to work with us please go in the description and you can schedule a call to speak to me and my team. Thank you guys I'll see you in the next one.